Meet your nemesises. Me and Minda. Wow. Oh god, I don't remember my Zed voice. Zed. Isn't this ironic? Here we are, all thanks to the dark magic curse you placed on Link. You speak of magic? Steal your tongue for a moment to whelp and I will tell you both magic and oppression of ages. That was not his voice, but it is now. The people of our tribe, a tribe that mastered the arts of magic, were locked away in this world like insects in a cage. You, you're ugly. In the shadows we regress so much that we soon neither or we soon knew neither anger nor hatred, nor even the faintest bloom of desire. And all of it was the fault of the useless do nothing royal family that had resigned itself to this miserable half existence. He's going crazy. Look at that. Goodness gracious. I had served and endured in that depraved household for far too long, my impudent princess. And why, you ask? Because I believe that I to be, uh, because I believe that I would be the next to rule our people. That is why. Oh, creepy. But would they acknowledge me as their king? No. And as such, I was denied the magic powers befitting our ruler. It was then, in the thrall of hatred and despair, that I turned my eyes to the heavens. And found a god. I'm running. No, he looks so sad. He's been rejected. And that's when the crazy began. Oh, don't no, I? No, him is my ruler, too. He's a creepy mother fur. It's a great ball of gas. It's going to consume you all. Ew. It's Ganondorf. I shall house my power in you. If there is anything you desire, then I shall desire it too. Oh my goodness, I'm filled with power now. I don't know what to think of myself. My hat is back on. My god only had one wish. To merge shadow and light and make darkness. Usurper King Zant. Dun dun dun. It's like a clock. Alright, so basically, this is an interesting thing, like, it's all a bunch of different things that we've done in the past. So, it's- oh, oh my gosh. No, come back, sir. Do that. Just say so yeah, just about your boomerang. And he'll come to the shore and slash and dash and flash and whatever yourself away. Don't touch the water because it's dark and dank, leave me alone. I mean, eventually he does, I think, calm down a little bit and get tired, but why, if you're fast enough to just kind of, like, get him? Oh, maybe then. See, like, these only take, like, a couple seconds each. Because he's a crazy fool. Oh, goodness gracious, we need our boots out now. Maybe. I don't actually know if we need Go away! Ugh, let's go. I actually don't really know if we need our boots. Unless you don't want to fall. Which is basically me not wanting to fall. Uh, where are you, crazy fool? Mm. Oh, there you go. See, he gets tired after a while. 
See, it's all about pacing, guys. Like, don't kind of, don't try to go like all out in once. Like, you gotta pace yourself because you'll outlast everyone by pacing than if you try to do anything else. Hmm, okay. Flash shot of the game. All right. So this is okay. This is what he does. He just gets these things out. Where's the head? It looks like a giant sand head. Okay. Here we go. Flash shot him out. No, I'm trying to flash shot you out, sir. And then slice at him. Arg. Alright, so that'll go away. And then I think he makes like pots. There are pots just hanging out down here. And now I think he makes like four of them come out. Maybe. So yeah, it's not really like obviously exactly like the boss battle that we had before, but it's still in the same arenas. He doesn't do all of them. But oh no no no. Sorry. I see you. Okay. Cool. And no no, don't swim away. You do not get to swim away. Alright, no, I think where does he take us next? And also they're not all just like boss battles, they're like mini boss battles too. So like these ones. Let's change back to our garb. Um, I think we need this one? No? Wait for him to do that, and then you can do that. No, no, no. no, no, no. What are you doing? I guess he used it to hit him off. I thought maybe he had to use your boomerang, but I guess we didn't have our boomerang in this fight. No, did we? No, we didn't. Crazy fool. Where are you going, sir? Ha! I caught you before it's too late. Ha 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 ha. Oh, that was too much there. Oh, he's sitting on his head. That was kind of funny. And I don't know, it's really hard to keep up with commentary for these because they just go by so fast. But, oh, now we're in Blzita land. And we need our ball and chain. He's super massive. Look at that. Upskirt shot in him. But he's wearing pants, so it's okay. Hit his foot. And he'll become tiny. And you have to just kind of try to catch up to him. Look at little Xantis. Alright, so yeah, he has this like twice. Meow. Oh, I'm unhappy. Okay, land on me. Not on me, near me, it's better. Ah. Okay, come on. Come on, buddy. Ah, catching up with him is probably the hardest thing. You wish you would just slow down. Haha. -ha. Alright, now I think this next one's the last one. If I'm not mistaken. Yep, this. Totally the last one. Now we're outside of Castle Town. And it's like he enveloped all of Castle Town in his thing now. So it's like no one comes in, no one comes out. Alright, so this next one he just like goes freaking crazy. Like sometimes he'll do these ones. And I don't really know what to do with him. But then he'll do these sometimes. And you just need to like get out of his way so then he can just slide around. It'd be crazy. Slow down. What are you doing? Go, get slow. Get slow so I can show them this. Ah. Oh, what you gonna do about that, sir? Wait, okay, so now he just goes crazy. It's completely crazy. I don't know. Can I shoot him with arrows? I've never actually really tried. No. Does not like them. Okay. Oh. Yeah, watch out for the best way is probably just to watch out for him while he does any of these. And eventually he'll slow down. Eventually. Oh, over here. Haha, -ha, go away. Get out of here. Get out of here. Whoa, he's crazy. Oh my gosh. All the time, just... I don't know where he's going. Oh my... See, look, he's just insane, literally. Ugh. What's with all these insane usurper people? Like, I just finished watching Avatar last night for like the first time all the way through, and Azula is crazy, so anyone who actually likes Azula, there has to be something wrong with you because she is insane, and it's to the point of being terrifying how insane she is. Get out of here. I don't know, people who like Xander are just odd because he's weird. But there's nothing charming or personable about him. Like, there's no personality tra traits that make him be cool. Like, at least with Azula, I can see, like, the only person- not even personality trait. Like, the only thing cool about her 
as the fact that she has blue flames. And that's about it. Are you done? Is this the last time I can hit you? Are you dead? Yes, thank you. Alright, we're done with you, sir. Get out of here. Crazy fool. I always thought his jacket was his hands. Oh, flatten. That's nice. <gasps> we get to see Minna's power for the first time because we got this back. Because remember, he, he stole them from us. So now we have them, though. And she feels so powerful. Huh? You, you traitors! You're the traitor! What are you doing? What are you doing? Traitors! Ha! You want to know why none would call you king? It was your eyes, Zand. All saw it. A lust for power burning in your pupils. Did you think we'd, lo we'd forget our ancestors lost their king to such greed? Midna, foolish twilight princess. The curse on you cannot be broken. It was placed on you by the magic of my god. The power you held as the leader of Twilight will never return. Twitch, twitch. Already he has descended and been reborn in this world. As long as my master Ganon survives, he will resurrect me without cease. Long, scary neck. Stab. And he blew up like a balloon. Which is probably, honestly, one of the most morbid things I've ever seen in a Zelda game. I... I just used a fraction of the power that's in me now. I did that using only a fraction of my ancestor's magic? Link, now is the time. We must save Zelda. The evil power that Sant was wielding, I couldn't... He, I couldn't take it from him. But at least I still have the magic of my ancestors. With it, I could return the cherished power that Zelda bestowed upon me. Now, let's go. Princess Zelda is waiting. <laughs> she seems so happy now. That's good. Alright, we got our heart container. And that's it. That's all the heart containers there is. I'll get you out of here. You're sure there's nothing else you need to do, right? Yes, ma'am. Let's go. Let's motor. Motor, 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 motor. Yes, I would like to save. Woot. Playtime. 25.05. Still doing okay for time. Like I said, normally I'd be done with the game by this, but with only like the Cave of Ordeals and the last temple or last dungeon left, not bad. So Ganondorf was just using Zant to help him return to the world of light. I guess now we know the true nature of that barrier over Hyrule Castle. He's in Hyrule Castle, I'm sure of it. Princess Zelda is in grave danger. We must return to the world of light and hurry to the castle. Indeed we will. Alright, so let's head back to the world of light. And call it a day. So yeah, I thank you guys all for watching. Sorry this video ran a little long. I'm still not sure if I'm just going to cut this in two or one. But I guess you'll find out when it comes out. So yeah, that Santa's no more. So Minda's free to take back her kingdom, which is awesome. And in the next part, we'll head on off to Hyrule Castle. Because there's really nothing else that we need to do other than the Cave of Ordeals. But I'll be lp exceptioning that later. So thank you guys all for watching. And I'll see you in the next part. Ta-ta! Bye-bye!